What's up dudes, my name is Nick. Welcome back for another music video reaction. We're taking a look at the like official real release, I believe this is, of the newest Mamamoo album titled Starry Night. Now, the other day, yesterday in fact, I, I, I listened to is it Sun, Star, Wind, whatever, the, 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 the different like elements and whatever it is. Um, and that song, you know, paired with their earlier release this year, kind of gave me the idea that this is going to be a little bit of a different vibe from Mama Mood than we've heard in the past, which I'm definitely very excited to hear that. So we're going to do what I do in all my videos here, and I'm going to listen to this. I'm going to find out exactly how much they're going to change, if they're going to change. And of course, I'm going to give you guys my honest first impression thoughts and opinions on it, whether I like the song or I do not. So if that is something you're interested in hearing more of as I cover other K-pop releases, click on the subscribe button down below. And of course, do not forget to watch all the way to the end of this video so you can get my full, complete thoughts. So with all that being said, let's get the song started. Silent intro. I hate the silent intros. I hate the silent intros. Like, stop it. At this point, I think they're just doing it to to troll me. I'm kidding. That's, that's, that's just me, you know, pretending to think that, like, I'm important, that they care that I exist. Probably wish that I didn't exist. Whoa, that was a striking shot. Holy... You know what this is reminding me of? Like, you probably haven't heard of this song, but if you heard the... I think it's a debut solo song from a from a female singer named Clang. It absolutely reminds me of that. Absolutely, it does. I like this one. See, I told you it was going to be something a little bit different, and like, it is, but at the same time, it's not. So, that's awesome. I'm digging this. This is fantastic. This song is killer. It's a little, I'm, I've been thinking, like, I'm just trying to figure out the guitar. Is it like classical guitar or is it something different? Or is it just regular guitar? I don't know, because it, it feels a little high pitched to be. to be just like a regular sort of acoustic guitar, but maybe not. I don't know. I'm just speculating, putting my thoughts out there. It's what reaction videos are for, right? What is this now? Is this a... What is this? 
This has got to be a teaser of something else that they're going to be releasing. That's what this has got to be. Or maybe it's just the outro. It's probably just the outro. Two options. Either this is just the outro and it means nothing, or this is... This is the, um, what was I trying to say? I was going to say something, or it was a teaser for something else. I don't know. Either way, that was, um, it was a fantastic song. So like I, like I said in the music, like during the beginning of the music video, it reminds me of this song from a, a, a solo singer called Clang. I can't remember what the name of the song is off the top of my head, but her... Her song, similar to this one, it, it has vibes of being a little bit of like a, you know, country pop kind of thing, which is really cool. It's a little bit of, it's definitely something different um, from what Mamamoo has done in the past. And it's definitely something that is very different from what you hear in K-pop just in general. So that's a lot of fun. That's really cool. I'm really, really kind of digging it. Um... You know, like like I had said, I was expecting it to be a a change for Mamamoo, and in in one on one side, it is a obvious you know change in genre and music style for Mamamoo to something that's well not necessarily the most pop influenced kind of kind of genre of music. It, it's a little bit more influenced, I think, um, by other by different genre of music that's not you know and not necessarily meant to be a pop song, so to speak, but it still does, of course, have, you know, a fair number of elements in this that I would kind of consider it to be, you know, what you would hear in a pop song. So, you know, it's not, it's not a, it still is a pop song, but it's not so much a pop song like they have been releasing in the past. But what does, what has remained the same though, is just the Mamamoo vocals. It still, it still feels like you're listening to a Mamamoo song purely because of the vocals. Like, if 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 I listened to this song and I hadn't noticed it and I hadn't you know I didn't know that it was a Mama Moo song I didn't know anything like that I'd have been listening to this and I'd been a little bit confused and I probably would have been asking myself or asking the person who was listening who was playing this to me I'd have been like I feel I'd I'd been saying something like I feel so bad like so strongly I'm so certain that this is Mama Moo but. I'm not entirely sure because this doesn't sound like anything that they would have that they've released in the past. This doesn't sound familiar to me, but it still sounds like Mama Moo because of the vocals. And I think that's fantastic. That's that's like, you know, kind of I think what I've pretty much said for every song that they've released so far this year is that it doesn't feel like Mama Moo, but at the same time it still has, you know, their the, the feeling of being a Mama Moo song, which is really really good. That's always 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 awesome when you know, a group can pretty effectively change up what they're doing and, you know, have the music still feel like them. You can still get their, you know, personalities and their character as singers and performers through the music that you have since the groups debuted. You know, it, it's it's always good to get that kind of stuff. So that's why I'm loving this song. It's a, it's a new and refreshing and different sort of genre and sound of music that hasn't necessarily been heard in K-pop. Reminds me of this uh, solo singer that I have been, that when I heard, when I first heard her song, I was obsessed with it for a good solid, you know, month or two because it's, it's a really fantastic genre and it's a really fantastic song. So Mamamoo going along those lines, I'm going to love it just for the same reasons. I love that song from Clang and that's 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 that so that's all i got to say about this song i want to know what you guys think of course down in the comment box below share your thoughts and opinions no matter what you think whether you like this song or not because if you don't like this song that's perfectly fine i'm interested in hear the reason i'm interested to hear the reasons why and of course this community that i'm trying to build here which is all about having some free and open discussion about our thoughts and opinions no matter what they are would also potentially be interested in hearing why you don't like this song or of course why you do like this song so Share your thoughts and opinions down below. If you want to join that community, of course, click on the subscribe button down below. And if you want to make sure that you do not miss a single video to know, and you get notifications every single time that I upload this video, click on the bell icon down there so that you can turn on notifications. So that's going to be it for this video, guys. As always, I want to thank you for watching, and I will see you all next time.